as a composer, I write songs with lyrics. <coughs> I never understood musicals when I was small. So we decided to take some of the songs and spin them together into what we call a musical. Thank you. Dear audience, you're about to share in the creation of a musical. Now remember, you can applaud at any time. Yeah. <laughs> I had a grand Irish school teacher named Mrs. McNamara. Back then, we had daily music lessons in the sixth grade, and her favorite musical was The Sound of Music, and we would climb every mountain with her. This was my introduction to the musical. I liked her, but I never really liked musicals because no one ever sang like that in my neighborhood. Now, dear audience, imagine the motion of the street traffic coming to a halt as the entire cast of our little play sings the theme song. Larry the Butcher, Frank the Barber, Pete, Old Man Phil, Marty the Mail Person, and Jimmy Mortimer from the Junkyard. And our dear Rachel. <laughs> flags down a cabbie and convinces him to take her to Mortimer's junkyard. Mr. Mortimer? Hello? Mr. Mortimer? Can I help you, miss? Oh. Well, do you know a John Grace? I, I found this book. Say no more, child. 
I don't want nothing to do with that fool book. Did you see the sun? I heard it's painted red Across the dirty head Of a Dodge Charger that's dead It's a junkyard sun It's cast in oil and spit With a black red grit A blackened bucket sits that are writ And there's your junkyard dog You know you found in years Closes the book. <laughs> He's so good at that. <laughs> the set is empty, except for a small house on stage right. Abruptly, a dissonant chord is banged on the piano, and Rachel hears a voice. Go away! John? John Grace, is that you? There is no John Grace here anymore, there's nothing left. I found your book, your book of songs. They're magical. You said you weren't afraid. Go ahead and open the book. Rachel hesitates. He timidly opens the book. Outside your door, see what they see. Someone, what we have. They're running from not loving in a pure way. We're moving toward a pure. John, I love you. <laughs> the end.